a very good day friends thank you for your response to uh, the first two uh, videos in this series this series aims to tell you why the uni why the earth is not 4.5 billion years but rather only a few tens of thousands of years i already gave you three proofs from physics uh, physics and biology the first is the presence of soft tissues in uh, fossils the second is the presence of carbon 14 in diamond and coal and the third is earth's magnetic field which has been decaying in strength uh, in case you missed these videos then click under this video where you find the name of this group and you will find the previous and also many other videos related to christian apologetics today uh, i would like to present the rest of the evidences slightly faster because the last two videos have laid a good foundation the next reason why the earth is not billions of years old is based upon the recession of the moon the moon is going away from the earth and the precise distance of moon and the precise distance by which the moon moves away from the earth in a given year uh, have been measured thousands of times using laser very high quality laser it is clear that the moon is gradually moving away from the earth and when all the values determined in last uh, uh, five decades is uh, tallied on a chart one can easily calculate where would have been moon 4.5 billion years ago and it becomes very clear that if the earth moon system were 4.5 billion years ago the moon would have been at the center of the earth which is an impossibility not on the surface center of the earth and since moon is not the, at the center of the earth it is very clear that moon has not been receding for 4.5 billions of years another uh, evidence is uh, again um similar to the diamond example there are lot of zircon crystals around and zircon gradually emits helium the exact process of emission is very clearly known the problem is if this zircon on the surface of the earth or in the interior of the earth were 4.5 billion years old all the helium would have escaped in fact helium doesn't need that much time to escape but the fact that there is helium left in zircon crystals and that they are still escaping shows that the earth is not billions of years old another evidence is from that of short lived comets i am sure you all have seen comets a broom like structure seen in the evening or midnight sky a beautiful scene a uh, large number of these comets have a very short life very very short life span of 10000 or less years the fact that they exist and the fact that they circle the earth shows that the earth is less than 10000 years old another evidence is from erosion of continents i'm sure all of you have seen what happens during heavy rain the mud on river bank be becomes eroded it becomes mixed with water and that, that's why the water turns the color of tea and all the mud that has dissolved into water goes into the river and from river into the seas if the earth had 4.5 billion years of age almost all mud on all continents would already have eroded and gone into the seas into the seas but the fact that there is a lot of mud left 
an unbelievable amount of mud left and the fact that the seven continents are still there shows that the earth is and these continents are not billions of years old and if the uh, if uh, uh, this mud had been eroding for 4.5 billion years then the seas would have been covered with miles and miles of sediments but when we go to the sea surface what we see is only a few inches of sediments which shows that erosion has been taking place only for a few thousand years not for billions and that in turn shows that the earth is not 4.5 billion years old another evidence comes from population statistics exactly how population grows is very clearly known it has been studied for hundreds of years and it has been analyzed mathematically to a very precise level using that level it that using that precise mathematics it becomes very clear that population on the earth is not more than 10000 years old and it is definitely not billions of years old these are nine proofs from the world of science not the sole nine proofs but i have selected nine which are easy to explain there are many more proofs and evidences from the world of science which are too technical to handle so i have avoided them but these nine proofs from the world of science are sufficient for any inquiring soul to understand that science does not really teach that the earth is 4.5 billion years old and as i had said there is a tenth evidence which is from the bible i gave you nine from science give me one chance to give one more evidence and that from bible the date on which adam was created from that date you can use genealogies to calculate up to today and it all adds up to about 6000 years if you reckon a few gaps here and there very few gaps and precisely known gaps then the maximum you can stretch is 7000 years the human population on the earth is not more than 7000 years old and the scripture says that humans were created not very far after the earth was created so the earth is less than 10000 years if you want to stretch it much maybe 20000 but not more than that a lot of questions may come to your mind not only about the age of the earth but also related to bible and science and let me tell you you are always welcome to send these questions to me i love questions the only thing is when i give you my phone number don't try to call me rather send me a whatsapp text message or whatsapp audio message or even whatsapp video message i will definitely reply them in due time i say don't call me because i may be in a class or in a recording and when i say in due time according to priority i will respond to them and if some questions are very important for the masses then i will prepare a video and post here here is my mobile number this is a whatsapp number 999 that is 999 999 5198690 one more thing we are planning to record hundreds of videos on questions related to bible science evolution you should not miss any of them and there is an easy way out under this video there is a link that says subscribe click that link and then you will see a link which is actually a bell icon click the bell icon once you do these two things youtube will automatically send you a notice the moment we post a video you will not miss even a single valuable video god bless you and don't forget to share this video with your friends and don't forget to send your questions to us